Hi guys, welcome back to my Challenge Tech Campus. So in this video, we are going to talk about hands-on platform introduction for Cucumber. Okay, so like many of people trying to uh, give the hands-on, but they are getting some issue. Okay, so in this video, we are going to see like how to launch a code, how to write a code, where to write a code, and how to run the code. Okay, so that uh, you can't miss the steps and the error will go. Okay, so launching will be uh, same for all uh, hands-on. Either you are giving Cucumber, Nightwatch, or uh, selenium okay so you have to click on launch we have to wait for some time okay and then this final page will open okay yeah now how to launch a course so if you see here na, so you can you will get this visual studio code editor we have okay so we have to open this one and then we have to click on this project folder inside this uh, inside this uh, visual studio okay so i have given the steps as well like we have to open the visual studio then we have to click on file okay you can see the screenshot as well here uh, file you have to click and then you have to click on open folder open folder then you have to click on desktop okay once you click uh, open folder so it will show you desktop downloads and all so you have to click on desktop now you have to select this folder okay don't directly uh, click on project and open this one go to this folder okay and then open it okay then click on okay open open it will be okay now uh, it will if it will come for a pop-up then it uh, you have to accept this one okay now we have to open the file cucumber.feature where we have to write the feature file okay okay now see oh uh, then now first we have to do one more thing okay we have to install this cucumber uh extensive extension okay so how to do this one so as as you click on file okay uh, below this one you will get uh, uh name like preferences so you have to click option preferences inside preferences uh, you have to go to extension okay once you hover the preferences then you will get this extension as well so you have to click on extension then you will land on this page okay uh, here you have to write a cucumber and when you click cucumber you will get two options okay so we have to uh, click this one we have to install this one given when then okay so this uh, jerkin or uh, you can say uh, we have to install okay extension we have to install okay so till now i think it will be okay okay it is okay for you now okay now uh, here also we have to open two files okay so we have to open annotation.py annotation.java and cucumber already we have opened cucumber.feature file okay so three files we have opened badly mm, to go forward yeah yeah and once you open this once you click on this uh, first see like where you will get this annotation and annotation java annotation py and annotation java where you will get okay so first let's see for annotation py so you will see python folder over there in the left side okay when you open the visual studio so you will get this python folder so you have to click on this python folder then at annotation py folder you will get just double click, uh, click on it okay now java where you will get like java not required but yeah you can open this as well okay so you have to click on maven inside maven you will find one folder cucumber just open this cucumber and inside this cucumber you will get annotation.java okay so you have to double click on this one so annotation py open annotation java open and uh, cucumber feature file open okay so now what to do okay now we have to write the code so where we have to write the code so in uh, we have to write a code in uh, uh, cucumber.feature okay cucumber.feature uh, file okay so how we will start okay copy given content so once you open this annotation.py now so you will find like this given a set of specific users but before going to this step first write these lines of code okay just write these lines of code from uh, manually okay no need to copy and paste these things just write from your own okay so uh, also you have to give three names actually what is the problem statement now so we have problem statement like uh, uh, we uh, they have given uh, three names okay and uh, inside the three names two names of letter five and one length one name of letter nine so we have to find out this one okay so code already given there okay just we have to write a feature file that will uh, uh, means like if uh, we have to write a feature file in a such way that it will uh, accept python uh, uh, code also and it will accept java code also okay now so just write like these two lines of code uh, just two images uh, have shown here so till here just write this one okay now now what to do after then okay now after then what we have to do so uh, after the month, then uh, after uh, writing these things now okay uh, i have to say one more thing actually i missed these things yeah so this given okay now uh, do you remember like we have installed given when and then 
okay given when and then means these three we have to uh, like think very carefully writing these things okay given when and then so feature is okay feature you can copy okay feature you can uh, sorry feature you can copy that is not an issue but yeah uh, features in i you can copy but given when and then we will discuss uh, in previous uh, after uh, uh, we will discuss in later slide so given given when and then you have to write very carefully okay so how to write given so just write given just type gi it will automatically give you a suggestion because we have already installed the extension right so when you write given so you have to give the scenario the scenario you have to copy from annotation.py annotation.py you can see here at the given a set of specific users so just copy this one okay don't copy this double quotes just copy the content a set of specific user and paste it here okay don't try to write from your end just copy and paste it okay now now you have to give the three names right so just give just follow this uh, code okay okay just follow this code and just give any name okay two of five and one uh, name with letter nine okay now third step okay given is completed now to left okay when and then okay so when uh, the content of when also we won't write manually what we will do we will copy this one we will copy this one this will found in same annotation.py when you scroll down then you will find this one okay so just copy from here to last okay uh, just copy this uh, double quotes as well if not need to worry we will remove this one okay so just copy this one so you will copy this one and remove this uh, flower braces name and just give the one name any one name from here okay so april and give you can give a license as well not an issue okay so give april in the double quotes okay because it's a string and we have to give this one okay now now again we have to then see here two times then that's why we are writing two times then okay then we will find just copy this all from the annotation py paste here number of people remove this number of people and braces and give two okay and remove this uh, slash okay just remove this slash and uh, again this length remove this length and give five in inside double quotes okay same with this one copy the whole line uh, delete this number of people and give one and uh, give nine as a length so what we are actually try to write here now we are writing like uh, we, we count the number of character in april so we found that two people of length five and one people with length nine so this we are this is the feature file which we are trying to write okay now what to do now after writing this all the things okay just save the uh, all open file okay now we will see how to run the code now this is very important okay like many of times we are writing code correctly but we don't know like how to run the code that's why we are facing so much uh, issue now how to run the code so first of all save all the open files okay whatever you have written just save it okay now you have to open a terminal okay terminal you have to open click on terminal click on new terminal okay just see if this if the path is showing like this way desktop project so don't click don't try to run anything because this is a wrong path okay we have to go to this folder i will show you you can see here uh, i don't know like i have shown in this lecture or not yeah yeah you can see here yeah so you can see this folder right this is the main project path inside this main project path why i am writing this one now because see what we have installed what we have which folder we have selected we have selected this folder now so we have to go to this folder first and then we have to run ssh and run uh, test sorry uh, run dot ssh and install dot ssh we have to write into this folder remember every time okay don't need to try to uh, run any in any folder it won't run it won't run here okay you have to first come to the, your uh, your project folder and then you have to write so if you are not there if you want to come here then just write cd space don't no, not write space just give cd and space means space from the keyboard okay just click that uh, long bar press press it okay now so once you give cd space and give this one wings 12 mini project you can write this one as well okay or you can what you can do now what you can you can right click on this one the project folder i have shown you right so you have to right click on this one copy path and paste here okay and just click enter okay so once you click cd space and this path folder now so you will land it on this page this is a correct one okay now now first we have to click install uh, sh install dot sh okay in terminal if you click sh install dot sh then you will land on this page it will ask you do you want to continue just press capital y small y also you can press not an issue okay just print capital y and click enter so once you click enter then you will pop, pop like the installation is done okay if not then not an issue okay there, no need to worry 
okay i think i have copied this from the night watch okay just remove this one okay so not required this one so once you click na it will directly open you okay now open a new terminal again and just type sh run dot sh okay just write as, uh, run sh uh, run dot sh in a new terminal okay and then you will get like this message oh, i don't know like this message also we are getting in this or not i think uh, we are not getting these two uh, these two images just forgot these two images okay i uh, actually i am using the same slide for night watch na so i forgot to delete these two images not an issue just open uh, one terminal print uh, type sh install dot sh okay click on y fine now open another terminal and give sh run dot sh it will automatically run and this uh, uh, this uh, image you will get okay this text you will get there it means two run two test cases are there all are passing okay so uh, you are good to go and you can submit your uh, assessment or uh, hansel okay so this is the full file okay so why i am written this one na? because i already told you right why i have written this one because i have to show you something like uh, this is not an indentation part okay so you no need to uh, follow the indentation like feature here scenario you have to write here no need to worry okay uh, because you can write in this way also and then it will also pass okay just just focus on these three things given when and then just try to write this uh, text from the annotation.py uh, only don't try to write from your end okay maybe like uh, if this space will be some uh case sensitive you can say that's why it is not running for you so just try to copy and paste these things rest all you can write from your end okay and yeah uh, here uh, you can give any name okay i have given this one you can give uh, based on your name nine letter digit should be there okay so i hope this is clear guys okay so yeah just try from your end once okay and then let me know just drop your comment also in the uh, comment section so uh, we'll meet you in the next lecture guys so that's all in this video thank you bye bye